Welcome to pre-math. In this video we have got these three rectangles blue, green and red as you can see in this diagram along with their dimensions such that the partial area of this blue rectangle is 36 square units and the partial area for this red rectangle is 26 square units and now we are going to calculate the area of this green rectangle please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe let me make it clear that this uh, figure may not be 100 percent true to the scale let's go ahead and get started and now let's focus on this uh, blue rectangle and now we are going to calculate the area of this whole blue rectangle. Let's recall the area of the rectangle formula. Area equals to length times width. And in our case, our length is 8 and the width is 7. So therefore, the area of this blue rectangle is going to be 7 times 8 means 56 square units so therefore the area between these two blue and green common rectangle over here is going to be this total area 56 minus this 36 therefore this is going to be equal to 20 square units so let me go ahead and write down this one is 20 square units and here's our next step let's focus on this uh, red hole rectangle and we are going to calculate the area of this whole red rectangle we are going to use this uh, formula once again our length is 7 and width is 6 so therefore the area of this uh, red rectangle is going to be 7 times 6 is uh, 42 square units then the area of this uh, common part uh, between this green and red rectangle is going to be 42 minus uh, this 26 so therefore this is going to be 16 square units so let me go ahead and write down this one as 16 and now let's focus on this uh, red green common rectangle let me go ahead and call this side as x units and likewise let's focus on this uh, blue and green common rectangle let me go ahead and call this side as y units so this total length from here to here is going to be y plus 2 since we are dealing with the rectangle if this is y plus 2 then this side is going to be y plus 2 as well we know that this length is 2 so therefore this length is going to be y units now let's focus on this part this whole length is going to be x plus 3 means x plus 3 units if this is x plus 3 then this other opposite side is going to be x plus 3 as well but we know that this length is 2 so therefore this whole length is going to be x plus 3 minus 2 is going to give us x plus 1 and now let's go ahead and calculate the area of this uh, blue green common rectangle over here this part we are going to apply this formula once again so the area is going to be y times x plus 1 and this is area is 20 so i can write uh, y times x plus 1 equals to area is 20 now let's go ahead and distribute this one so we are going to get x times y plus y equals to 20 let me call this as our equation number one and now let's focus on this other rectangle 
this one red and green common rectangle so we are going to use this formula once again so length time width is going to be simply x times y which is equal to 16 let me call this our equation number two and now let's go ahead and plug it in this uh, x times y value which is 16 in this equation one so therefore let's plug it in this one 16 plus uh, y equals to 20 now let's go ahead and subtract 16 from both sides this is gone so our y value turns out to be 4 units and now we are going to plug in this y equals to 4 value in this uh, equation 2 so therefore this equation is going to become 4 times x equal to 16 and now let's go ahead and divide both side by 4 so we can see that this 4 and 4 cancels out so therefore our x value turns out to be 4 units and here's our final step we figured out our x value equals to 4 and y value equals to 4 as well and let's go ahead and substitute over here i'm going to replace this x by this 4 and likewise this y by 4 as well so therefore this side of this green rectangle turns out to be 4 plus 3 equals to 7 and likewise this side of this green rectangle is going to be 4 plus 2 is going to give us 6 units so we figured out the length of this green rectangle as 7 units and the width turns out to be 6 units so the area of this uh, green uh, rectangle is going to be we are going to apply this formula once again so let me go ahead and write down area equals to length times width area will be equal to length in our case is 7 let me go ahead and write down 7 times width is 6 so the area of this green rectangle turns out to be 42 square units so thus the area of this green rectangle turns out to be 42 square units thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye